Let's just bring it into the present a little bit with The Walking Dead. Walking Dead has a big presence here at the con, as you know. Um, we ended last season, it was interesting because there were some real structural changes, you know, between the two arc governor episode and then solo focusing in on the characters. Do you foresee this season being a little bit more back to being an ensemble or how do you foresee the structure being in the coming season? Well, we're, uh, we're almost halfway through in terms of scripts for the season. And, uh, you know, I, I think that there's an opportunity to do both storytelling, um, to have what is very much an ensemble piece, but also to be able to fall, follow individual characters. Because we got such insight not only into the governor, but Beth, who is a character that people didn't know much about. Um, and, and those opportunities are really gold, I think not only for the actors on the show and the writers, but the audience to be able to connect with who they are. Last, obviously they've been left, we left on a big cliffhanger there. And Which is also something <laughs> we've never done before. We never, never had, had a, a big cliffhanger hand ending. I mean, I assume we're going to be finding out what's going to hitting right back on that moment which is interesting that's another change there's usually a time jump exactly so yeah. so we you know we 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 like to think that we we have a few tricks up our sleeve um that are very much character driven but we're not just playing out the same scenarios over and over again last season also it sort of dealt a little bit with i thought people coming to understand the characters coming to understand that they could do monstrous things without becoming one of the monsters in the world that they were living in. And that was reconciling, look, in this world, whether it's Carol or Rick, we're gonna have to do horrible things. Yeah. But that doesn't mean we're one of them. Right. Um, what sort of is the trajectory of this season? What would it thematically? You know, I, I think we'll be challenging our characters again because it is a world in which the stakes are life and death, and but they're life and death every moment of every day. You're never safe. and you'll see them pushed to the limit. Um, and characters that haven't necessarily had to face those ethical and moral decisions uh, will have an opportunity, will have an opportunity to see what they do when they are.